The fugu, also known as a puffer fish, has toxin 250 times more deadly than cyanide. Yet it is a prized delicacy in Japan and it contains genes of similar structure to the human genome. Singapore's premier Institute of Molecular and Cell Biology is part of an international consortium led by the Joint Genome Institute of the United States Department of Energy to map out the puffer fish's genetic blueprint. This project could bring us closer to understanding the human genome and is part of Singapore's plans to stimulate an R&D-driven effort to develop our biomedical sciences industry. Our goal is to develop Singapore as a biomedical sciences hub with capabilities across the whole value chain from basic and clinical research to product and process development to manufacturing, regional headquarters functions including marketing and finally healthcare delivery. We focus on four areas pharmaceuticals, biotechnology, medical devices and healthcare services. An international advisory council advises Singapore on the developments of the biomedical sciences industry. The council is made up of eminent members from the global biomedical sciences research community and industry experts. New initiatives launched to grow the industry include US $600 million to attract world-class corporate centers of research to Singapore, US $600 million investment fund for co-investment purposes, and US $600 million to support public research activities. World-class companies leverage on Singapore's strengths for their activities. Leading pharmaceutical companies have invested over US $1.5 billion in state-of-the-art global manufacturing facilities to produce top-of-the-line pharmaceutical products. These companies are also diversifying their manufacturing activities to include biotech products. Singapore is a strategic location for us largely because of its very developed infrastructure, very committed and very visible government and labour support. Chiron, one of the world's top biotech companies, formed a joint venture with Singapore to undertake small molecule and genomic-based drug discovery. Other biotech companies here include Genset and Oculex. The Bioprocessing Technology Centre continues to strengthen its capabilities in process development and pilot-scale biologics manufacturing. It is a value-adding partner to many local and overseas biotech companies. Medical device companies have made Singapore a strategic base for their global operations. When we first came to Singapore, it was for low-cost manufacturing in 1989. Since that time, we added product development and now research and development. It's a great place to attract the kinds of scientists and engineers you need to make things really work. Companies can tap on capabilities of a strong group of supporting industries in areas such as precision injection molding, printed circuit board assembly and original equipment manufacturing. Trained manpower on good clinical practice and state-of-the-art hospitals and specialty centers makes Singapore the premier location for clinical research and clinical trial management in Asia-Pacific. Lily wanted to come to the region to establish an R&D presence. Singapore was very good in that regard because of the multi-ethnic population. We're often doing ethnic comparison studies. For example, in this study today, we're studying Chinese here. We will also be studying some Caucasians and we're collaborating with a center in Japan. Contract research organizations such as Quintiles and Covance provide one-stop facilities for companies to conduct clinical trials. A range of research institutes supports research in the various biomedical sciences clusters. We attract the best talents worldwide to conduct cutting-edge R&D through international collaborations and partnerships. For most groups in IMCB, uh, maintaining collaborations worldwide is extremely important. For our own group, we have uh, collaborators in Japan, in Britain, in North America and in Canada. 
to help stimulate the growth of the biomedical sciences industry, the Economic Development Board has invested in over 50 startups and mid sized biomedical sciences companies. We work closely with industry and academia to train skilled manpower and increase the supply of biomedical sciences talent for the industry. Schools and university curricula now have biomedical sciences education as an integral part of general education. In addition, Scholarships are awarded to students for undergraduate and postgraduate studies at top universities. Singapore is strategically located at the crossroads of global business. Combining the strengths of world-class transportation, telecommunications and e-commerce infrastructure, the Tuas Farmer Park offers land for pharmaceutical companies. Anchor tenants include Merck Sharp & Dome, Wyatheist and Pfizer. The Biopolis, located near tertiary institutions, hospitals and research institutes, provides space for lab-based R&D activities by the industry and will house vibrant public research organisations. Singapore wants to build the biomedical sciences as a fourth pillar of our industry. Our aim is to make Singapore a biomedical sciences centre. We are putting in place the key infrastructures of manpower training at the tertiary level, encouraging public-private research and also building infrastructure to house these investments. We want to be your partner in biomedical sciences and we want to attract your investments to Singapore. We invite you to join us in our efforts to develop better cures and improve the quality of life. Be a part of the exciting biomedical sciences landscape in Asia. Be in Singapore.